So it's just about uh, 3 a.m. I've got my my mask on in the midst of a, of a rush that essentially they are putting Wuhan, the city limits, under a lockdown. Wuhan in China now on lockdown as the country struggles with fear of a pandemic. Desperate measures to try and contain the deadly coronavirus. More than 11 million people who live in that city now kept from leaving. Just stepped aboard a train leaving Beijing, we're headed to Wuhan. That's considered the ground zero, the epicenter, if you will, of this coronavirus, hence the name Wuhan coronavirus. The most alarming thing that's come out of all of this is the fact that according to Chinese health officials, this is confirmed to spread from one person to another, human to human. to Wuhan, about a five and a half hour train ride. We're gonna go check in and get a real assessment of what things are like here. They've closed off the entire market area. No shopping is going on, no business whatsoever. It's just empty. We suggest that if it's not necessary, do not come to Wuhan. And for Wuhan residents, if there is no special requirement, do not leave Wuhan. So we have made our way to the train station here in Wuhan. I want to give you an idea. There we are. In a long line of people. It's 4.15 in the morning here. So we've just arrived at the second train station where we're hoping to catch uh, the 7 a.m. train that would take us after four and a half hours back to Beijing. We've noticed along the way that uh, some people have been lining up, actually trying to get rides by car out of Wuhan. We've made it uh, aboard the train, departing shortly for Beijing. 